All right, ladies and gents, also at the end of the story, you'll have some comprehension questions asking you, what is the theme of the story? So let's review, okay? The theme of a story is what the author is trying to convey. In other words, the central idea of the story. Short stories, such as the one you read, often have just one theme, whereas our novels usually have multiple themes. We learn many different life messages from novels. The theme of a story is woven all the way through the story and the characters' actions, interactions, and motivations all reflect the story's theme. The theme is not, it is not the story's plot, it is not the moral. Often readers at this level think the theme is a synonym for a moral that is incorrect. The plot, remember, is simply what happens in the story and the order of the story's events or sequence. The moral is the lesson that the writer wants the main character and you, the reader, to learn from the story. Each of these serves the overall theme of the story. That is, the events of the story. Illustrate the theme and the lesson that you learn relates directly to the theme. So when you're trying to recognize the theme, which you'll be asked to do shortly, ask yourself what the author is trying to convey convey based on what the main characters are doing, the events of the story. So you're paying attention to what the characters in the story are doing and saying. And in fifth grade, you will have to infer the theme. Okay, they're not going to come out and say, here's what I want you to learn from the story. So we look at the example, three little pigs. The third pig's actions are motivated by his not wanting the wolf to get in his house. So from this lesson, we can look at the plot, the action of the characters and say, hmm, what can I learn from the three little pigs? And again, the theme is not one word. It's not friendship, love. The theme is the message. It is a sentence long. So from three little pigs, maybe we learned a life lesson, hard work eventually pays off. I think that would be a wonderful theme sentence from the three little pigs. Again, in most stories, the author will not tell readers what the theme of the story is. Kindergarten, first grade, picture books are going to tell those kids the theme, fifth grade. We have to think about what the characters did wrong or right and what they can learn from the character's experience. I know it's a lot of information. I want you to remember, if we go back to the beginning here, the theme is what the author wants us, the reader, to learn from the story in our everyday life, a lesson that you can take. It is not one word. It is a sentence based on what the character's actions were doing, what the main character was saying, and that will help you reflect what the overall theme or the message is. How I always remember the theme, ladies and gents, it's spelled T-H-E-M-E. The first three letters spell the, the next two letters are M-E, and M-E are the first two letters in the word message. The theme is the message in the story, how you can learn a life lesson. So you will be asked to do that. And hopefully that helps you. I want to see a nice sentence, not a word, and look at what the characters are saying and doing. You got this.